This is Dr. O and the Dr. O Show. Here we are today with a case of severe osteoarthritis and osteoarthrosis. You can actually hear the, uh, we come in fairly close, bones grinding on one another. And this, as we move them, so do. Good box, good box. Westy. of C1 to C3, there's so much arthritis in his neck all the way down at the bottom that when he first came here, he wasn't moving at all. He really wasn't moving his neck at all, but now he's at least moving. Let's go to Lassacola. He wasn't hardly had any motion. And because the majority of the rotation of the head is coming from the atlas and axis, the upper segments of the spine, he's never going to get full range of motion in terms of rotation because of the fact that those vertebrae are fused together but we can make up for it and compensate for it, at least in the lower neck area. We have some x-rays of this, uh, which you can see now on your screen. You can see how bad the arthritis is in this area, but we've certainly done a lot to improve the motion. It's moving a lot better now, right, than it was at the beginning. Uh, yes. It's not perfect, but your dad's head was hardly moving at all when he first came in. He was like, looked like a, a robot, you know? He was, had nothing. So I'm pretty actually satisfied with the amount of motion that he has. But I'm better. I'm better. Yeah. At night it's worse because there's more inflammation, there's not as much, there's more water uh, collecting and it's creating more compression and okay. it's always worse at night. All right, so there you go. There's a case of severe osteoarthritis and uh, degenerative disc disease and uh, fusion actually of the vertebrae, which is what happens when the spine is left too long unattended. So if you've got this kind of arthritis, you need to get in early, in the early stages, to prevent it from fusing together. This is Dr. O and the Dr. O Show.